Alright, so hello guys and welcome back to Retron channel on YouTube. So in today's video, I'm going to show you on how to actually solve the MacBook Pro problem. Well, actually this issue is actually have pen on almost every Mac MacBook computer. So uh, when you guys trying to reinstall the OS and once you click on reinstall, it leads you into a verification page and then this is this is what happening it said an error occur while preparing the installation try running this application again so no matter how how many time you try you will end up in this screen so a lot of people don't know what to do and I found this on the web that many people really frustrated for what they see on the screen like this and looking forward for any you know possible solution so in today video we will show you on how to actually go through this problem and making a smooth installation on your Mac computer so once you reach on this page and seeing something like that seeing a pop-up and warning you that there is uh, some error occur while pre preparing the installation like that all you have to do is to go back just click on OK it is a very simple step just click on OK and then it will lead you into this uh, OS 10 utility so what you're gonna do next is to go to the utility up there and then go on terminal now here's the fun part the fun part is that when you try to type in a command prompt in your terminal for a date 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 and press enter it will set that your clock is not up to date yet even the date so here it is July Friday July 2nd 12 12 a.m. PDT 1999 but what actually happening right now is that it is not 1999 it's actually the time and the uh, date in here is 6 p.m. and January 31 Sunday 2021 so what you have to do is you have to actually recorrect recorrect the date of your MacBook Pro so this is the installation issue because of the incorrect date and time set back a the installation into an you know an error and make you unable to continue to install the OS properly so what you're gonna do is to recorrect the date so how do you do that in order to recorrect the date all you have to do is to type in the same command prompt for date date and then now you have to enter the correct date and timeline for example right now is a uh, we are on January 31 2021 and it's 6 p.m. so the correct time format is the first one is the month so I type in zero. Oh, you have to leave some space also so I'm gonna leave some space sorry 01 for January and then today is 31 so 31 and now is 6 p.m. 6 p.m. in translation would be a 18 yep 18 and then the minute is 32 so I'm typing in 32 and the year would be 2021 so now this is how you gonna recorrect the date format of your MacBook Pro inside the terminal so I'm gonna enter so now it's set to Sunday January 31 at 6 p.m. 6.32 p.m. and 2021 so now when you try to type in the same command prompt for date to asking asking for a clear you can see that it still remain on 2021 so now you have corrected the date and then you have to close the terminal click on terminal again click on terminal and quit terminal so again this is a 20, 20, 2009 MacBook Pro a mid 2009 MacBook Pro and need to be reinstall the OS so now all you have to do is to go to reinstall page again click on continue okay so it will lead to the uh, installation and verif verification now here we see we land on the OS El Capitan again so we're gonna reinstall the El Capitan and now let's press continue to see whether there is any error occur still available or not continue now they set it to download and restore OS 10 
your computer eligibility will be verified with Apple so we're gonna continue to verify and now here is the last part when we land on this page it pop up the the problem it pop up the issue so now when we have correct the date let's see whether the issue is still on or not oh boom now you have sold it you don't need to be stuck on the same page again because you have recorrect the date and now they are letting you to go to proceed into the next step to install your OS L Capitan so I'm gonna click agree yep so this is actually how you going to solve the issue occur during the reinstallation of the Mac OS so please give me a thumb thumb up comment comment your idea if you interested into this video and would like to see any more upcoming video in the future then don't forget to subscribe so now I'm agree again agree so a little bit slow so now you can see that I able to choose the disk which one in order to reinstall so thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next video bye